Hi, Professor Chill here again, Rupert Till, Professor Rupert Till from the University of Huddersfield. Um, and I'm talking again about ancient musical instruments. So, there is an ancient instrument called a bull roarer. It's called a rhombus in other parts of the world. It's got different names in different places. Um, there's an old film called Crocodile Dundee that kids, if you talk to someone older, they might know about that. And in those, they show some of them from Australia. So Australian Aboriginal people still use these things today to make, to make sound, to communicate, and also to, uh, kind of a musical instrument or signalling device. But these things are found um, in archaeological sites from thousands, if not tens of thousands of years ago. They're very ancient and they're actually found all over the world. They're found in Europe, they're found in the Far East, they're found in Australia, they're found everywhere. So they're very common instruments. Now you can make one of these really easily and um, I'm going to show you how. So you don't need much for this. You need some string. Here I've cut some string out, some scissors to cut the string. And I suggest um, a ruler. Uh, here's a six inch ruler. Here's another one, here's a metal one. Here's another metal one, a longer metal one and a longer plastic one. So I've got a kind of teacher's marker pen here. I'm just gonna, but any pen felt it will do. And I'm just gonna make a mark roughly in the middle um, to give me an idea of where I need to make a hole. Then I'm going to use my knife, and this is actually just a normal kitchen knife, but any sharp knife. You can use a braddle, which is a, a proper woodworking tool, proper hole making tool. Um, you could use, you could use probably um, a drill if you can access to a drill. Ask a grown up to help maybe with this bit. So I'm going to stick this into there, and actually, what I'm going to do. With this is I can just turn it round like this and actually even with this knife it might blunt the knife a bit it might not be very good for the knife but not very difficult look there you go done it you'll see a nice neat little hole so this piece of string is kind of about six feet about two meters tall so I've licked the piece of string to make it sort of smooth all I'm going to do is pop that piece of string through the hole. I can twist it a bit to help it go through. Ah, it's not going in. I'm just going to do this to the end to make it a bit straighter and hopefully poke it through. Yeah, there we go. It's gone through. Pull the piece of string through. Then take the two ends of your piece of string like this. And if you just hold them Bring your thumb and your finger and put your second finger there. Wrap the string round your hand so you make a loop and then just tuck the other pieces, the ends of the pieces of string through and just tie it. And you've made a really simple lock knot. So you just tie the piece of string together with the other end of the string through the ruler. You can see already the rulers Starting to spin round and round. I'll just wrap this round my hand like that so I can hold on to it nice and tight. And what I'm going to do is spin this round my head. Plastic, six inch, 15 centimetre uh, ruler bull roar. Sounds nice, but it's a bit lightweight. 12 inch ruler, a bit heavy. Flies quite well. Um, it's a nice low bass sound. 15 centimeter small metal ruler. <laughs>
you can buy metal rulers and they often have a hole at the end which you can thread the string through which make it really easy to make a ball roller. You can see there are lots of different ways to make ball rollers. I've got another video that shows you how to make one out of cardboard. It's not as good because it's a bit light. Um, you could get a little bit of wood, a little bit of balsa wood, modelling wood. You can buy thin strips of wood in DIY stores. And anywhere that sells wood, you can buy little strips of wood and just cut that into size quite easily. Uh, you can round off the edges, you can decorate them, you can do all sorts of things to them. So see if you can make your own bull roaring.